Bienvenue à cette troisième émission de Apprendre avec John Bins. Aujourd'hui, nous allons regarder ensemble Yes, No Questions and Tag Questions. Alors, bonne écoute! Welcome to the theory part of our show. We're going to be looking at neg negative yes, no questions and tag questions. Let's go directly to the PowerPoint. So, this isn't dangerous, is it? This isn't dangerous, is it? Isn't this fun? These parachutes work, don't they? We didn't get, we won't get hurt, will we? You haven't done this before, have you? So these are all uh, tag questions or yeah, negative questions that follow or come at the beginning. A negative yes, no question or tag question, we use them to check information you believe is true or comment on the situation. Now look what we got what's going on here. I pull a blue cord, don't I? Don't I pull a blue cord? I don't think he's ever parachuted. So both sentences, uh, in both sentences, the speaker believes that he should pull the blue cord and wants to check this information. Use negative yes-no questions and tag questions to check information you believe may be true or comment on the situation. Isn't the view great? The view is great, isn't it? In both situations, speaker is commenting on the view, but will a bird really talk? Hmm. Negative yes-no questions. Uh, like affirmative yes-no questions, negative yes-no questions begin with a form of be, an auxiliary verb such as have, do, will, can, or should. Aren't sharks vegetarians? Haven't you had lunch yet? Can't you swim somewhere else? Like, these are all negative questions, and notice they're using auxiliaries like haven't, can't, or aren't. Didn't you see the shark warning sign? So we continue to tag questions. Tag questions with statement plus tag. The statement expresses an assumption. The tag means a, a right or isn't that true. So it's a long way down, isn't it? The statement and the tag. The other one. I went the wrong way, didn't I? The statement and the tag. But notice one is affirmative, the other is negative. In the statement, the verb is affirmative, the tag is negative. And if the statement is a negative, the tag is affirmative. This rope will hold me, won't it? Affirmative, negative. You don't talk too long, we won't talk too long, will you? Negative, affirmative. So, form the tag uh, with the form of be or an auxiliary verb, such as have, do, will, can, should, or the same auxiliary that is in the statement. But notice what we have here. You bought life insurance, didn't you? Didn't. He has done this before, hasn't he? He's joking, isn't he? Isn't he? He isn't joking, is he? Now, if we continue, in the tag, use only pronouns. When the subject of the statement is that, the subject in the tag should be it. Tom isn't enjoying this, is Tom? So Tom should be changed to he. That wasn't my parachute, was it? Okay, when you sum the subject, the statement is that, change the subject to it. Notice the it. So complete the tag questions with the correct tag. You can swim, can't you? So, how can we do this? This is high enough, isn't it? Will it? Won't? Will? Do we? Don't? Have? Do we? 
Did he? Didn't bring? Did he? Has she? Hasn't given? Has she? Shouldn't we? Should check? Shouldn't we? And doesn't he? Donc Bob does this all the time. Doesn't he? And this is our final PowerPoint. I hope that uh, you have appreciated what we have been learning here. But yes, no questions and tag questions. Now go on to a practical part with a student. Hi, Roger. Welcome to the third show of Aprendre avec Jean Bins, then the practical part. Hi. How are you today? Very good. You? Good, good. Are you ready to work? Yeah. So we're going to talk about tag questions and yes, no questions. Okay. So you're going to be able to use your auxiliary verbs. Yeah. So I'm going to show you a sheet here. The first sheet is going to be relatively easy. Okay. Basically, what I want you to do, and you can see here, I want you to match the letter with the statement is here. Okay. If called movers, it's uh, F, having you. Mm -hmm. They're coming tomorrow. Uh, aren't they? Mm -hmm. H. This is going to be expensive. Uh, it's it's the verb to be to be don't we no what is this? isn't it isn't it he oh okay you haven't finished parking uh, parking or packing packing oh <laughs> parking Have you? Good. D. We don't need any more boxes. Don't we? Mm, we don't need any more boxes. Do we? Uh, do we? Uh, hey. We need to disconnect the phone. Mm -hmm. Don't we? G, the movers supply boxes for us, don't they? Mm -hmm. C, moving is never easy, it is? Is it? Uh, is it? <laughs> B. So the trick here, Roger, is to, if you have an affirmative, your tag is negative. If you have a negative, your tag is affirmative. Okay. <laughs> so now we're going to go into another sheet. Okay. Okay, we'll change. Here, you have a sheet, and there are 10 mistakes. Okay. And using the use of yes, no questions or tags, the first one is corrected for you. Okay. So that's easy. Yeah. I want you to read through the sentences and find nine more mistakes if possible. Okay. And tell me what they are and correct them. Okay. Uh, Joe, that depends on what you mean by a long time. Doesn't that? Uh, doesn't is the mistake. Good. Doesn't it? Good. Yeah. Okay. Are not you afraid to show your face er, Vancouver? Uh, are not. Okay. I mean, how should it be corrected? Uh, A contracted form. Aren't not. No, aren't. Aren't. Joe, I can take care of myself. I'm still alive. I'm... I'm... Uh, the mistake is there. Yeah, 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 but what is it? Uh, I don't know. Aren't I? Aren't... Aren't... Aren't I? Mm -hmm. Okay. Then and until, the pronunciation is aren't. Aren't. Until someone recognizes you, you're still wanted by the police. Are you sick? Aren't you? Mm -hmm. Aren't. Very good. You. But that 
as never but buttered bothered buttered buttered you as hasn't it uh, hasn't it okay what's the mistake uh, the tag should be uh, 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 I'm not sure uh, you have a negative tag shouldn't the tag be affirmative uh, by affirmative is uh, has it has it mm -hmm. okay Joe I, I I will be gone by morning look I need a place to stay just for one night I'll I'll be no nope. mistake no no, no. Uh, the sentence no, is no mistake is, is perfect no mistake is correct okay I have to think about my wife and kid don't you have any place else to go Good. there's no mistake there either yeah yes I do there's no one to turn to but you you have to help me so is there a mistake there uh, yes there's no no at the beginning the very beginning yes I do so that should be uh, yes I don't okay no I don't no I don't uh, no okay so we'll just do the last two here quickly okay we're almost finished okay okay continue I've ready already helping help to plenty I went to jail for you haven't and didn't I kept my mouth shut so didn't I didn't, didn't I keep my mouth shut didn't I okay we're gonna have to stop there with that sheet Roger okay that was a little hard eh? yeah sure <laughs> but I think you did pretty good you found most of your mistakes I'm proud of you okay so we'll go on to another exercise and another type of grammar rule in the next show OK, thank you. J'espère que vous avez bien appris aujourd'hui comment utiliser Yes No Questions and Tag Questions et vous allez appliquer ça dans votre conversation. La semaine prochaine, nous allons aborder sur un sujet de make, have, let, help and get. Lots of words. Donc, à la semaine prochaine. Cette émission d'accès est appuyée par Cogeco et est rendue possible grâce à la collaboration de la communauté avec nos TV.